I'm Amy, I'm living in Chrysalis, and today is one look, four palettes. <laughs> Let's get to it. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. I'm just gonna throw on uh, the Pixie Lip in Really Rose. Nice, pretty, pinky neutral. Moby pinky thing. I've been meaning to try. Hmm. I've never used Pixie before. Can anyone tell me if uh, if this has just gone off or if this if the smell is a little unpleasant? Do let me know. If you want to feed the algorithm like subscribe comment share all that good stuff let's jump into the look so i have to use four palettes for this one look because i hit the kohl's 50 percent off sale on butter london day Ooh. i have been eyeing this for quite some time but i've been waiting for the 50 percent off sale because this is real this is all shimmers it's all pale shimmers this one is called Glaze and Shimmering Eye Palette. And it's beautiful, but it's not a, it's not an all-in-one palette. It's really just um, an accessory. So I had to break out some of my magnetic palettes to make this work. I'm going to go into my Urban Decay Foxy, which is just, um, yeah, it's a, yellowy setting shade. My other one is a pinky setting shade. So between the yellow and the pink, I figured this is just a nice basic setting shade palette. My man, Matt. <laughs> this is um, some Mary Kay singles, some um, repressed, some uh, some singles that I mixed up myself and a couple of depotted Smashbox Basics. I'm going to go into this sort of greeny gray that I mixed up myself. I realize everybody and their brother has a makeup line now, but truthfully, I think it would be so much fun to mix up shades. To, to do little batches and such so maybe sometime I'll try that I mean I I mix these up out of existing shadows you know what this lipstick smells so gross I'm just I, I can't I can't deal I think that's gonna go for the, straight to the bin unless I, unless I can maybe exchange it I'm not sure Oh, I will see. I mean, I won it, so at least I didn't pay for it, but yeah, it's a little upsetting. Now I'm going to go into the outer corner with this Smashbox shade here. I don't remember the name. I think it's called Vintage, actually, but I'll double check. Oh, that's quite chocolatey. Now let me see if I can make that work. Oh, whoops. Oopsies. <laughs> oh, I got a boogie. My son was late getting ready and took longer. So, you know. Of course, whose routine gets cut short? I'm going to go with... A highlight shade I think I'm gonna use this shade from the balm it's a depotted nude tube palette I don't remember the shade name but I'll put it up there we go Ooh. we got to get powdery that's okay now I get to blend this whole thing I have to remember to repress another shade in there before I I put it away later. 
Hmm. I think I'm gonna kind of hit that gray shade again, the greeny gray. A little touch there. I'll just hit that there. And take out my new butter palette. And I'm going to use this shade right here. What's the shade name? Um, copper? That ain't copper. What are we talking about here? It says copper. It doesn't look copper to me, but whatever. It's not in the pan. Oh no, that does not look copper at all. Look at that. I'm just kind of laying it down with my finger because I don't have much time and I gotta go. And I think I'm still gonna need a brush. Okay, hang on. Just to fill it in there. Why did they call it shade copper? That is not copper. It's like a greeny gray. That's why I picked the eyeshadow single I did. Which, like I said, I can't tell you where to buy it because I mixed it myself. Sorry. I got to do the things and I'll be back. Okay. I've done the things except my hair, but I'm not going to have time to come back. I'll try to do an outdoor shot, but no promises. But here's the final look. Do let me know what you think. And of course, if you haven't already, subscribe. Please subscribe. Thank you so much, and I'll see you soon.